Hello, today I have the opportunity to talk directly from Estonia. Before the end of the year, I took the opportunity to come here to see the plant running. And it's so cool. And I, I'm really happy to be here. So I'm now in Estonia and they are producing a pipe 1000. This is the newest machine we have. This is the KR900, like brand new with all the new development. And on the top you can see the yellow, it means we are in production. We have this uh, coding, the color coding of the status of the machine everywhere. I'm here now with some customers from other country and they're really impressed about Estonia and the plan and of course the machine. Now I'm very close to my machine and uh, I will show you again. So this is the core tube coming in. Peter, very famous everywhere. Here you can see the output of the pipe. Extruder 1 with 270, extruder 2 with 400, and core extruder. This is the actual output. Then on the second screen you can see all the orders. So, this is like really cool and very uh, proactive and very modern. Including the uh, they call the machine, they have a nice little robot because the labor costs are a little bit high here. They made a, a robot called Natasha and this is the, the name that the workers gave it. This is automatically feeding of the extrusion with polyethylene, polypropylene and you can see in the back the yellow color. I hope I can uh, make a little video when Natasha is moving. So here you can see Natasha is picking up one bag, moving all the way to a different hopper. And this machine was supplied for ASG Robotics here in Estonia. This company ASG Robotics is from Estonia. Yes. Yeah. So I will make a link in the nice video. Yeah, of course. Because this is not made by Kra, not at all, but it's really impressive and it's helping. It's helping a lot for all the handling. All the all the people are really happy because they don't have to drag the bags around anymore. But you can see the workers, the arms are reduced. Before they were all strong, but it's really like impressive. So here we are. This is the cooling station with uh, two pipes, 1,200 and 1,200. And you can see already on the air, it's like a big air cooler on the other side. And here you can see the production, the speed, the socket. Everything is very nice and very beautiful. You saw in my last video of uh, my widget in the Philippines. And this machine has bigger outfit and like running, running really, really nice. You know, this is now a little bit more secret, a new development where we can make cuts and everything directly on a mandrel. So the pipe is placed on a mandrel and we have a robot on this side and we will see how the robot will make cuts during the time the pipe is still on the mandrel.
And here you can see like the color coding is working. Blue means they are now setting up. Red means mistake and green means production. So this is a nice machine. Okay, here we go. The robot is moving. The mandrel is turning. And it's really like cool. Nice here in Estonia. See, this is like a three meter where they are welding now, like the, the bottom. And you can see the hole somewhere here or here with electric fusion jointing. And welding, like it's a like real cool project they are doing here in Estonia. And here's some other fitting. Very nice, like a, a branch, a cheese piece. Here it looks like a normal tea. And on the other side. And I some market here. Director with a connection. Over here. A lot of very nice little fittings. Hole, band, many many things in different sizes. See, you have the little one, and behind you see the big one, a uh, 3000 mm. Here they are working in something else. Really cool, really, really cool. Another day here in Estonia, and you can see here behind me welding of electrofusion of a pipe 3000 mm. Like basically the same principle, so you see how big it is. You see the chain and you see the connection. This is like a very big storage tank. And now all welded by electric fusion with the joint, with everything. Really, really cool. Here we can see inside, like really cool. You can see the tension ring from the inside. From the outside, it's our standard chain, and they usually are doing the welding now with two welding machines at the same time because the size is very big. And here we are. Here you can see the the chain and the connection of the electric fusion. And the electrofusion device you know already so but this is a big big joint and it's very important during the welding here in Estonia to give the hero a real name and I will show you now this little device and the beautiful Alexander you know, if you call devices like this, the joint will be more than cool. <laughs> 